I'm excited today to talk to us. I still remain your host, Obi Udeze. Today we'll be discussing from this wonderful book, The Testimony of the Last Spirit. Today's discussion is on the power of a right place. There is a place of your miracle. You do not need to be everywhere for a miracle to happen. Our part is putting effort in finding out the right place of our miracle. Being in the right place is repositioning for your miracle. God can never give miracle to a wanderer. One of the ways to know that you are in the right place is that you will not be overtaken by the spirit of wandering. By wandering, I mean you will be in church today, tomorrow in another different church. Spirit of wandering scatter the labor of men. Those who are captivated by the spirit of wandering can go to seven churches in one month. Mm. They will have more than one father in the Lord. That is ridiculous. Men who are in the right place of their blessing are mostly awake when others are sleeping and they do phenomenal things. They do not move around in search of miracles because they have understanding that blessings are given in families. Another sign that you are in the right place of your miracle is that you will find grace both with God and in the sight of people around the altar. There will be so much grace upon which is an unmerited favor from the Lord. Many people have been delayed in life because they are in a wrong place and doing the right thing you can imagine being in a place without blessing as a result of wrong bad positioning one need to be in the right place at the right time while doing the right thing to facilitate miracle one of the most important thing in life is to find out the right place of your miracle and then take advantage of the place it is a great thing to know when you are in the right place of your miracle there is an attitude of a right place you cannot be in the right place of your miracle behaving anyhow and still expect miracle there is an attitude against our miracle as well as there is an attitude that can attract our miracle which one of this attitude are you manifesting in the place of your miracle? It is a question I would leave for you to answer. Hannah in the book of 1 Samuel 1 in Shiloh, a place of her miracle, behaved in a way that attracted her miracle child. Your behavior in the right place determines your miracle. We should not trifle with behavior because a bad behavior has the power to keep someone down for a very long time. Focusing in the right place of your miracle is essential. Those who are in the right place of their miracle don't get distracted. They remain focused and have a staying power which made them ready for their miracles. We've come to the end of today's episode. Our next discussion is on feeling. Thank you for tuning in. Bye.